my fifth choice is the M240. I don't really like this weapon. You know, it has a really high rate of fire and really small damage rate. So it's not that good for me. If I use it, I'll use it with the grip and the red dot. For my fourth choice, I picked the RPD. I find this weapon really similar to the AUG HBAR. Um, they have similar rate of fire, really close accuracy. They're they're pretty good at far range, far range. And the attachment that I would prefer with this is the grip. For my third choice, I picked the AUG HBAR. Very similar to the RPD, as I said. And the attachment I'll use with this is the grip. My second choice is the L86. You're going to be thinking, why this weapon? Well, it does have a ugly recoil, but if you put the grip on it, you can do pretty well with it. And I always put the grip with the ACOG scope, a well, special ACOG scope, and it works really well for me. For my first and final choice, it is the MG4. This weapon has a really high damage rate, and it has a pretty decent rate of fire. The attachment I use with it is the grip, and since its sight isn't the greatest, I will rock it with the thermal sight as well. Alright guys, my fifth choice for LMGs is the L86 LSW. Um, see, I don't use LMGs a whole lot when I play Modern Warfare 2. Um, so you can imagine I barely ever use the L86. I, I don't touch it at all, really. Um, so I can't really comment on it. Uh, I don't know any of the stats because I don't use it. So um, if I had to have an attachment, I would say grip because LMGs usually have pretty high recoil. So I'm guessing this one does too. My fourth choice for LMGs is the M240. Uh, same story as the L86. Again, I don't really use LMGs that much, so um, this one is no different. I don't really use the M240, uh, so I can't really comment on it. And again, grip would be my attachment uh, with the theory of LMGs being very jumpy on the recoil. My third choice for LMGs is the MG4. Um, not much different again. I really, like, I really don't use LMGs that much, and MG4 um, doesn't fall far from there. I uh, I don't really use it. The only best I know from the MG4 is the um, is that mission on campaign. So uh, yeah, uh, grip again. All right, number two uh, for LMGs. Now, I finally can say I do use the RPD. Um, surprisingly, this weapon is pretty good. Um, obviously, it has 100 bolts in the clip, which is more than enough. Extended mags is not needed. Uh, the recoil's, again, a bit jumpy, so obviously grip is needed here. Um, the sight isn't bad, uh, but it could use something better, a little bit better, uh, like the red dot sight. Um, so, yeah. Um, sometimes I will use these and substitute for snipers since they are pretty good. Um, and uh, yeah, that's all I have to say about the RPD. Okay, number one. My number one choice is the AUG H bar. I like this weapon because I'm I like to use a lot of assault rifles personally, and the AUG is the closest LMG you're gonna get to an assault rifle. It has the smallest clip, so extended mag might be needed. However, putting grip on this gun makes it extremely accurate. Um, if you follow the uh, the graphs they have on the game, this actually boosts it to maximum accuracy, filling the bar. So, uh, yeah, I would suggest um, blinging this out with grip and extended mag.